Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back, DJ Ology, the science of DJing. Uh, so happy to have you guys here. Uh, I know everybody's pretty much on lockdown, and I've had quite a few people ask me how to do some streaming. So uh, I figured out how to do some different things with Twitch, and I'm going to go ahead and share it with you guys. Now, once again, if you like the channel, please subscribe, share, ring the bell. Um, we're, we're happy to be growing this community, and once again, thank you guys for tuning in. So without further ado, let's just go ahead and get into what we got going on so the first thing you're going to want is obs now just so you know uh twitch is the what uh is the website service that streams everything uh from your computer but obs is what you use to broadcast from your computer to twitch and then you end up sharing your link on facebook or whatever your social media is and get people to jump from your social media over to your channel now the first thing you're gonna need is OBS open broadcast software don't worry I'll have links for all this stuff within the description also a link to the DJology uh, Facebook group once again guys make sure to join that I post everything in there as well uh, I like the community going everybody asks questions and we get it handled so um, once again we're gonna put a, a link for OBS inside uh, of of the description of the YouTube channel and uh, we're gonna put a link to OBS inside the description so with uh yeah once you guys get that make sure to download that video producer and then from video producer you're gonna go to preferences preferences channel and then you want to copy that code and then you're gonna go ahead and put that into the OBS it's going to scan your system and say, hey, we want to do 60 frames per, per second and a few other things. I didn't really check too much about it and just let that go. So I think I'm going to go ahead and just delete these. You see the sources in the center and you you got your screens over there to the left. I mean, you can set different scenes depending on, you know, you got um, different things you want to take care of. It's easier to jump from one thing to the next thing. Display capture. And then I had named that second monitor. It's better if you have a second monitor. Uh, it's going to default to the first one, which gives you that, that mirror for ever ending. And then I just go ahead and select the second monitor. And inside that second monitor, I have my mixed emergency output. I just uh, clicked on the expand. So it's just going to be black right there. Then I can click on it again. And then it goes back to the, the, the regular smaller size. <clears throat> what do we have up next? I'm just moving that around a little bit. And then, of course, you could re reshape it. And I've got my uh, DJology logo uh, as the desktop for the second monitor. Um, go ahead and add a second source. Window capture. ME. So you'll find over here that you can do a whole bunch of different things. You can get your master output of your mix emergency. And then, of course, those red lines, you can reshape whatever size. You know, you can have it however you want. A lot of cool options you have with the with the OBS, and then of course we're gonna do what is that video capture device? Definitely video capture device, and that's where you're gonna get um, your extra video sources, FaceTime camera, and then here we are. Look at me! Yay! All right, once again you can reshape it, put it wherever you want, and then over here in the sources you can you know oh I want mix emergency to go above face cam, I want second display to go above the rest, which you probably wouldn't want to do that. I want second display on the bottom, it feeds from the top down is how it's layered. So we're gonna go over to YouTube. I'm gonna leave a link for this video as well. And this is how you separate and make like a little mixer for your audio. Now, with that being said, I have, oh yeah, we're gonna have to install that. With that With that being said, I have my controller running into a Scarlett uh, Focusrite, six in, six out. You're gonna need that to split up some sound. Um, I took that uh, software, I uh, Show You is the name of the software that splits up the audio within the computer and when I did this all with one computer go ahead and install that so once again you have Serato when a controller XLR is running into a focus right and then I have out of the focus right I got some XLRs that are running into a mixer if I want to plug in extra things over here and then I also have that mixer running into the speakers so you have a little idea how I have the signal flow going on um, you're gonna have to yeah, you type in the password for that. Okay, so now that we got that installed, what else are we going to do here? Oh, 
give it a second and bam cool close that go to your midi make sure it makes emergencies running right I think I installed okay so you got you to play a little bit with your sound make sure you got Serato up and everything ready to run over there so now I'm gonna test the sound uh, nothing's coming through so like I was saying before I had everything running through a sound card and then I just wanted to activate the sound so I could hear it live uh, so I acted, uh, you know, I set I set one of these channels into record, which activated it, and then also I hit the audio, uh, the auto, I hit auto uh, on that channel, and then you can hear the sound live. It's coming through. Okay, so we get on a um, multi output, and then all I did was hit built in, and I show you audio capture. And then it gave me all the sound that I needed. You see, it's working right. Got to make sure the master device is on audio out. You see, I clapped my hands right there, so the device was taking in from the microphone that was hooked to the laptop. So now I'm going to add another device. Um, what did I call it? I show you. I actually did that one wrong. It's not the I show you microphone. It's the... Um, this the next one. I don't even know. I show you didn't even work. I was like, I didn't, I didn't know why. <laughs> That's just me playing around with it. All right, so let's load a video and see what we got going on over here. Now that it's working and I got the controller running, I got everything going the way I want it. Now let's make sure it's getting ready to stream. I had to do a little trial and error with that too. Okay, so I had it running and I was like, oh, why isn't it running? Let me see. All right, so Mixed Emergencies running, Master Output's running. What's going on here? Didn't figure it out. We'll go ahead and pull up OBS. So we pulled up OBS and oh, now it's running. We just had to make sure it was going good. I had to do a little playing around with the sources. It's good to note that ME was frozen. I don't know why the master output was frozen. I had too many things going at once. So I ended up um, blanking out ME. And just uh, taking the master output of ME and Mixed Emergency and making that full screen while not siphoning the ME to the, to the master uh, output. See, I had to do a little switching around right there. Just play around with it. I'm sure everybody's system's a little bit different. All right, so now that we got everything working on on the on the computer end, let's go ahead and see if we can uh, do this live now. So go to Twitch, pull up your account, uh, turn it online. Probably don't want to go to that one. Let's go to um, your channel. All right, so once you hit your channel, you're gonna go ahead, hit play, but. The only thing wrong right here, I didn't hit start streaming. There you go. Hit play, and then it uh, will all work eventually. You're going to have to turn down the volume of the website because it's going to be a little bit delay and it's going to throw you off in the studio. So just play around. See, this is what I'm going to do turn the volume down. And then here you go. You got it running. Let's put a little tag on there. 
wouldn't be straight without DJology running across the top. So let's go ahead and do that. Yeah. 